Good afternoon from me and Jamesy boy. We are packing for our staycation, right? He's being so good, just hanging out on the bed, listening to some music. Um, we actually just ordered some Uber Eats. We're kind of already in vacation mode. Um, Dad is on a run, and we're so excited, right? Yes, yes. Good early afternoon. I meant to take this opening shot on Park Avenue, but was just in the groove of the running. Taking a lunch run today. Um, I just never know these days how my work day is gonna be. I could have no meetings and all of a sudden be in meetings from start to finish or later, like last night, working until 2 a.m. But I think that alleviated some stress today, so I was able to get out on a lunchtime run. But then, Vacation begins. I don't fully work until Tuesday. I come kind of on call for COVID related emergencies, but my team's gonna hold the fort down with everything else. So I'm very excited. Tomorrow we check in Wilderness Lodge, kind of like the beginning of the Christmas festivities week of Ultra Great. This is what I ordered for lunch, hummus house. We've never tried this, but it's really close to us. There's Peter, I got him falafel. Honestly, this this dude got me so hungry today watching him that Peter's like, you just need to order something. Just order something. Also, I forgot to mention that I got gyro meat. And this place lets you get so many toppings. It is the best and there's so many sauces. This is what I come out to from my last meeting of the day. I'm kind of on vacation now. Yay! Got to do a little bit here or there, a little bit here or there. You know how it is. Yeah. When you get I to this level in the corporate little, world. A little cat nap. Because it's raining out. We had more of an active day. We did. Are you ready to check into our resort tomorrow? Yes. Mm -hmm. Did you get a text? Yeah. Oh no, I forgot the camera at home. Well, as you can see, I'm at Whole Foods or on an off ramp at I-4 by Whole Foods. Going to the P.O. Box. Going to some stores to get ready for our staycation. P.S. Work was nuts, but it's over. If you don't say it enough, I just want to say thank you to everybody who sends us Christmas cards, just cards in the mail. Ooh. Little packages of love and friendship. We greatly appreciate it. Ooh, look at this one. That's fancy. Two Christmas cards and a Disney file. What's this gonna be about? What's this gonna be about? Oh, yes, baby. Look at that, that's cool. The Magic of Disney's Animal Kingdom, The Lion King, Progress Support, New Digs for the Happiest Horses on Earth. I'm gonna try to go see this this next weekend. Yes, yes, yes. Love it, love it, love it. Warm chocolate cake with molten raspberry caramel center. Ooh. Okay, I'll read this in our DVC stay. How about? <gasps> yes. Alan Menken, right? No, Howard Ashman. Yeah, both. Yes. Yes. All right, I don't typically like to go to this Walmart because it's like a super touristy one right by our P.O. Box, by Universal, by the Icon. But we're hoping to find some swim trunks that James is probably going to grow out of in the next month or two. And we're hoping to do a little dip dip this weekend. So I'm going to look for some swim diapers and a pair of really small trunks, as well as pick up some snacks, of course, because we can't check in uh, our DVC room without some snacks. Okay, it's a vacation classic to get some admins. But I wish they had the small ones too. I mean, they've got these hostess ones, but there's not admins small guys. I think I'm gonna get these plain donuts as well. <laughs> so I'm on the phone with Peter. Say hi, Peter. Hi guys, Sarah did me wrong. <laughs> and I set James down in his crib to like 
go through his clothes and then I realized it was like a momentous occasion that like his dad should have been there for. <laughs> should have been put on the vlog. But now we're here. Oh, he lost his sock on the way over. But anyways, he's a fan. He's very happy. Oh, stretch, 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 stretch. So much more room than your bassinet. I did not expect to get all of this for the snackage. Also, no dice on cranberry soda. Cranberry pop. And also, no uh, chunks for Jamesy boy. Or swimmers for his size. I hope they make swimmers that size. But maybe they don't. I don't know. Walmart took too long, so I'll have to go to two stores in the morning. But tonight we're having Chipotle again. Because of when our, they messed up our online order, they gave us a redo. So that's what we're here to do. Get dinner. Oh, this clip was filmed literally two minutes after the last one. I don't think I've ever gone into a Chipotle where I was able I was the I was able to walk up. The person in front of me was basically done with the first person with the first station. I've never had such a seamless visit to Chipotle. And everything looks good that they made, so hopefully this will fully redeem this Chipotle in from our last experience, which you know, was alright. But things happen. Look at these little surprise treats Peter brought home. I'm just gonna sit here and pretend like I'm not only interested in your Chipotle. Ooh, treats for Eve. And I feel like Muppets Christmas Carol has been our most watched Christmas movie this season. Yes. It's so good. I can't wait to watch it without me. I feel like you've been watching it without me. <laughs> she was just sitting up totally straight like a parrot. <laughs> And Peter. So Gonna miss her while we're gone. Now we're watching the family stone. Peter isn't sure if he loves it or hates it. What happened? Wait, I just remember who this girl is. That girl from that movie and she gets sick. Little women? Yeah. <laughs> Peter is your cute. No. no. She's, um she's she's Rory. <laughs> Dor Doris? No. Dorothy. I'm Dorothy. <laughs> no, I'm Judy Garland. I'm Judy Garland. Who is Dorothy? So it works. Um, not Meg, not Joe, not Kristen Dunst. I you call know. yourself a little woman. <laughs> What's better, 90s or 2019? Controversial. <laughs> Put a comment down below. You know where my heart lies. His name is, her name is Beth. Look at that outfit she's wearing. And Amy's the other sister's name. Look at these two sleepies. We have work to do. Just a little. We do have some time before we go tomorrow in the morning. Yeah. But I hog James all day, so. We're catching up some. It's only fair. Hey everybody, I'm still here. Look who's asleep by themselves. Sarah was a champ and did a bunch of packing while me and James were sleeping, but I, I got up. And I'd like doing the dishes and helping getting other things packed. Um, I told Sarah I want to bring a second full luggage to bring the snacks and computers in just so I didn't have to worry about a bunch of little bags. That has turned into an overflow of James's stuff, our shoes and everything, and a bunch of other tchotchkes. And the computers aren't in here, and a few other like last minute toiletries and stuff like that in here. So this is our second luggage for this four nighter. But there's a lot, like this is like 50 to 60% food. So like it's a full, this is the Disneyland one that we bought on our honeymoon when we came home with literally a whole additional luggage. But we drove a rental car to California and so that was like accumulation of things we bought all the way from Chicago to Santa Monica and then a bunch of stuff at Cal in California at Disneyland years ago. So, so funny but very, very excited. Would you have ever guessed after how sleepy Peter was in that last clip that we rallied and did so much prep for tomorrow, which is so nice because I kind of was just thinking like, we'll just have to get it all done before we go. Um, but now we'll just have to do like really quick, pack up things um, and head out. And it's perfect timing that this little boy's waking up because we're gonna go to bed. So I'm gonna nurse him and then Peter's gonna give him a little topper off bottle. I'm proud of us. 
watching all my... And, like, James and I fell asleep for, like, an hour, and I was in, like, deep, deep sleep. Like, my sleep apnea chest pain thing even happened. Mm-hmm. So, like, I'm Speaking already... Speaking of, we haven't heard from the... I know. The test I should probably call them soon if they yeah. don't call. Yeah. Um, he's fussing, but I'm ready to go. Like, I'm ready to stay awake all night now. Oh! I thought we were going to bed early tonight, but... We're all set for tomorrow, pretty much. Daily message. It is... December 16th, Wednesday. The message is by Arthur Rubenstein. To be alive, to be able to see, to walk, to have houses, music, paintings. It's all a miracle. I have adopted the technique of living life, miracle to miracle. Ooh, I love it. We got everything, almost everything accomplished. Mm -hmm. What's then, left is like things we have to wait till yeah. tomorrow. Are you guys excited for Wilderness Lodge vlogs? I loved our vlog from our 10 year anniversary when we stayed there. And our last time there obviously didn't, we didn't actually end up staying there because I've had my fall. So excited. It was still fun. Yeah. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. Look at these power veins. I love them. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.